Hi everyone, welcome back to the Maz channel. Thank you for tuning in. I'm going to show you a little haul today from the Range Christmas selection. Uh, a few days ago, myself and James popped to the Range just to find some particular baubles that I wanted. Um, I wanted some in like a plum glass colour to go with the room. Now they were my primary concern in going there uh, because they're the most difficult to find. Um, I do want to have like a blush pink, silver and white and plum coloured tree this year. So I will need some blush coloured baubles. The range had loads of lovely ones and white ones as well. But I will need to get kind of more of them and kind of blend the tree and then have the darker plum colours as like an accent colour so I will be getting probably cheaper versions of the blush colours in a multi-pack or something like that so I'm going to show you what we picked up in the range and also a little look around the store so you can see the Christmas section in the store and then um, James also filmed a Halloween section as well as some of the Christmas section so you can have a look at that so thanks to him for filming that um, and then afterwards at the end of the video I'll show you what I picked up also we popped into McDonald's as well and just had a little drive through so I've loved the whole shopping trip I hope you enjoy it let's get on with the video Right, we've just set off early this morning. We've just arrived at the range. We're going to pick out our Christmas baubles for this year for our tree, aren't we? Yeah. So let's hope there's not that it. many people. It's <laughs> what time is it, honey? We're set off. It's, uh, well, it's nine o'clock, so it's opening time now. So hopefully there'll be nobody much in. Yeah, so fingers crossed we'll get in there and find the ones we're looking for and get out without too, bumping into two, can't we, honey? I've got some particular ones that I want, yeah. um, which are like a That's plum colour. That's what we're look, colour. looking for, isn't it, So they're year? the ones that I'm most bothered about getting, you know, because they're the hardest colour to sort of come by. And then I can get all the blended colours cheaper in. Mm. Right, wish us luck. I'll see ya, bye. See ya. plum glass colour but they're larger and different designs to what I saw online and they've barely got anything compared to what they usually have. They usually have rows and rows and rows of um, different ones and this year they're very sparse, there's hardly any purple at all, any plum which is what I was looking for but you can see all the different ones they've got. These are about $1.99 each or less this is the section I've mostly been looking in. I'll just show you these ones. I've got quite a nice pack there. Some colours that I would like for £2.99. Same, isn't it, honey? They've got the it's ones you wanted. Oh, yeah. And beautiful clear ones as well. But again, these, are, these plum ones are just replicas of the ones over there. I mean, they've got some beautiful things. Uh, they've got some really nice blush pink which I also want to get but I'm going to get cheaper ones of those because it all the cost mounts up as you can see there's a lot of bare shelves and this is you know this is quite early on this is only um, October There's quite a lot of this rose gold colour. What do you think of these ones, honey? They're quite nice, aren't they? Mm. They would probably go as well. Move them around, you've got some ice blue. That's a lovely colour, Joe, isn't it? Yeah, they're quite nice, aren't they? Everything's around £1.49 or 
Like you say, how many, how many did we need for the entire tree, honey? I reckon we need about 30 of the uh, plum glass. And then did you say about another 20 of the other ones? Um, probably, yeah, probably more. Yeah, 20 white or something like that. But probably more of the blush pink. Um, so here's the blush pink look, talking of that. They're really nice, um, high quality baubles, aren't they? They are, they're quite large as well. Um, they're larger than I kind of expected. I was going to say, they do look a lot bigger in person than they do on they the do, website, don't definitely, they? definitely, yeah. Huge. Like in comparison, we might have to think about how many we need, because yeah, you might, might actually not need, need as less many. of them. Yeah, exactly. A six foot tree, you see, you're probably going to not need so many. These are nice. And I really do like these iced. Might get a couple yeah, of those snowflake on, ones, Jay. Yeah, do you want to pick a couple of them up for me? I'm going to yeah. drop these. Yeah, it's all right, I'll get them for you. They're really go. nice. <laughs> Some unicorns. Yeah, it's very, very sparse. Maybe they're still putting stuff out, honey, and maybe they'll maybe. still get some more stock in too. I might ask the assistant if she's got any. Yeah, ask them out the back. You never yeah. know. They might, they might just have them sitting in the warehouse at the back and not put them out yet. They're interesting, those antler trays. Big bows here. Not really my sort of thing. Wreaths and garland, don't they? Say that again, Jay. What wreaths? Yep. Right then, we just got back out from the shop. Uh, we had a nice look round, didn't we, honey? And they've got a lot of their Christmas decorations all out. Um, but we couldn't find the the, one, the exact ones that we wanted, but we did no. find quite a few of the ones that we did, didn't we? Um, but one of the shop assistants said that if we pop back, which we're reluctant to do really because of COVID, um, but she said the, the store should be getting more and more selection in probably sometime soon. So Yeah, she said the stock's coming in quicker now, but at the yeah. moment it's pretty thin on the ground compared to other years. Yeah, there was a few empty shelves in there and mm. that's probably going to be filled up with some, some other baubles that will come in later on. But, you know, we'll come back and see if they're going to get them because it was last year, wasn't it, the ones that, that you wanted? Uh, yeah, they were there last year and then this year they replicated them. Mm. Um, they're on the website, they're like a darker purple, kind of edged in mm -hmm. gold glitter and um, a frosted one as well, but none of them were there. So. Mm really disappointed in that yeah um, but it, we did get some stuff in got there some really nice so. ones still in plum but they were larger not what i'd seen so we'll show you those when you mm -hmm. know when we get back yeah so it was a successful trip but we, mm. we've just got to get some more of the other ones later on yep still a nice nice trip shopping nice trip shall we um go mcdonald's then and get yeah, a drive let's through. go get a macadies we've heard that they're doing double big, big macs for a limited time so we're gonna <laughs> have to go and have a look at one of them so We'll see if we can go and find one of them at the local drive through Yeah, that sounds like a, a good for plan. now. But First McDonald's drive through after the lockdown, really. And, uh, yeah, book muffins. And then some nice coffees. coffee and tea. Yeah, a couple of coffees. <laughs> it was actually breakfast menu only at this time of the morning, so we've had to go with McMuffin, sausage and egg McMuffin, but we don't mind that too much. And a tea and a coffee indeed right so i hope you enjoyed that little look around the range with us i'm going to just show you now what we picked up <laughs> this is the bag of joy um as i said we didn't get the particular baubles that i wanted they were like a purple color and they were a smaller size bauble um, but i did pick up lots of really big baubles in a plum glass color um, so I'm now wondering whether I need to order more of these and just forget about the purple ones because I don't know if they're going to be in stock again or whether to just wait for a bit and see if I can get a mixture of these and the purple ones I was originally looking for. So I'll just show you the bag. Look at all those lovely baubles in there. Right, so the first design I'll show you is this one. Uh, it's a really large 10 centimeter bauble it's um, like a, a transparent plum glass 
or is it plastic I think it's glass and then it's got the gold glitter and the kind of quilted look to it really pretty uh, gold top on it there as well so I've got several of those obviously I'm not going to need too many of those because they are quite big the second style bauble I got was this one this is more of an onion shaped one again it's like a big 10 centimeter one and it's just the same as the other one really with the the gold glitter on it these were about uh, what were they 149 or oh, 199 the third style I got was this it's the purple onion glass bauble this one's at eight centimeters so it is a more manageable size and I got the most of these ones they're like a proper blown crackle glass they're beautiful and I just think these dotted all over the tree a few of the bigger ones just as an accent mixed in with quite a lot of blush pink using this kind of colour as an accent colour and purple ones as well as an accent colour I just thought would look really nice and then finally the final style I got was I caved in and did buy a blush pink one separately I got a couple of these they're like an iced sugary effect with a glitter snowflake piped onto them I just love these I think they're beautiful um, they were 149 each and I got a couple of those so obviously I got several of each of the designs and yeah I do need to get a tree as well unless I use one of my family's um, older ones um, and I will make a video obviously nearer Christmas of um, me decorating the tree and all the colours that I get hope you've enjoyed this video if you have please give us a like and a subscribe that really does help me out on the channel and thank you for watching I'm going to leave you now with a look around the range at more baubles and Christmas decorations and also the Halloween section as well. Hope you've enjoyed this video. See you in my next one. Bye.